Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I decided to start a vlog right now. I'm actually leaving LA over here in Philadelphia. I've been here for over 24 hours. I've been a slam clicker this month. I'll explain to you why. But yeah, this is my hotel room and I am leaving now. Grab my mask, got my bag, and let me just double check the room. I actually, <laughs> so I'm very weird. I like to help the housekeepers out and I take my sheets off of the bed. Um, all right, I got everything, all of my chargers. All right, we're good. Today I am the galley flight attendant on the 787. I'm flying on the Dreamliner. It's actually my new favorite airplane. I am in love with 787 Dream <laughs> Dreamliner. Um, anyways, heading out now. I'll show you guys a little bit of the plane and then I'll see you guys later. I'm back home now, you guys. As I told you earlier, I just completed a two-day trip. It was a 30 or 29 hour layover in Philadelphia. We worked one flight over to Philly yesterday, and then we worked one flight back home today. Super easy trip. Like, if I could literally work this trip for the rest of my life, I would be the happiest flight attendant in life because this was so easy, and my position, business class galley, the best position ever. I just love being in the galley because I love being organized, getting everything ready, making everything look nice, and it's like my favorite favorite position so I had a great trip and the reason I said earlier that I'm gonna be a slam clicker all month long is because I am on a cruise diet if you guys saw my last video I think I told you guys that John and I are going on two cruises uh, we're going on a Disney cruise in May and then we're going on a virgin cruise in July I know kids cruise and then adult cruise although Disney Disney cruise is not a kids cruise there's plenty of adult things to do and I know a lot of people are like why are you going on a Disney cruise again that's my prerogative uh, Disney cruises are amazing and relaxing and I just like love them so much much. But anyways, yeah, so I'm trying to get my cruise body ready. I only have about three and a half weeks to go So that is the plan for this month. I'm gonna be a slam clicker I'm just gonna be like hanging out by myself in my hotel All I do on my layover is go to the hotel gym and work out for like an hour and a half It's something that I used to hate doing but now the more that I'm doing it the more that I actually enjoy doing it It is 10 30 p.m. I've actually been working a lot this month, but yeah, John should be home soon I'm off for the next four days tomorrow I'm, I'm seeing my best friend Samantha who is in town I know a lot of you guys have seen her in previous vlogs usually i see her when i'm in la but now she's here in south florida for a little bit so we're gonna see her tomorrow i'm happy to be home with my children my little old man and my little lady oh and by the way guys i don't know if i mentioned but john and i are moving <laughs> we're moving out of this apartment as much as i love this apartment it's time to leave it because they just increased our rent by almost 600 dollars. so john and i are moving out we found a new place and it's much cheaper yeah i don't know what they are thinking increasing our rent almost 600 dollars. that is like like when i found out i was so livid like how do you do that to people like how do you increase people's rent 600 dollars? i know prices are going up for like everything right now but for rent 600 dollars. Yeah, no. So we're moving out and obviously we'll do a whole moving vlog, but that's not gonna be for like another two months. We are downgrading. We currently have a two bedroom. We're gonna go down to a one bedroom. The next day. Samantha's here. Hello. It's your first time on the set of Life by Francesco. Yes. How does it feel? Very exciting. I don't think I've seen you like home in like a while, a few yeah, years. Yeah, yeah. So this is home for us because this is where we met in South Florida. So Samantha's just here for a few days or not for a few well, days. Well, I've been here for almost two weeks. <laughs> and then you're leaving when next week? Yeah, in a few days. And then I have a San Diego layover. <gasps> when? You're just um, announcing it here? Yeah, on the 19th. Okay. Yeah, you'll be there, right? Yeah, can't wait. Anyway, I'm gonna make us some oat milk lattes, which I've been dying to try one. And I bought- Can I have a flat white instead? Really? Do you I know how to do that? Well, there's an option on the machine to oh, make wow. it. I think it just means 
less milk than a latte. Oh, really? Okay, yeah, I can do that. And then I have the fancy oat milk. Okay, I don't know if that's a flat white, but this is a taste test. I'm maybe need more, more milk. Oat beverage. It's just strong. Yeah. I and think it's sugar. Because the cups are small. <laughs> I mean, it tastes good, but probably just sugar would help. Sugar? Oh, and if you don't notice my hand. <gasps> Samantha is engaged. So cut to the clip where we were at Five Guys by near LAX when you were there on a layover. Oh my God, and yeah. And I was like, oh my God. Francesco said, Samantha's boyfriend. I'm like, don't say that. We haven't defined the relationship yet. Oh my God, how many years ago was that? I mean, it's gotta be at least three. Oh my God, I remember that. Yeah. And now he's my fiance. You're glowing. It's because she has a boyfriend oh, now. Stop. She has a boyfriend now. Cut that. All right, cheers. Cheers. To my first oat milk latte. Definitely need some sugar. No, but I think it's a, that first taste you're, mm -hmm. but then. But it's good. I can taste like yeah. the oat. Openness. Yeah. So we decided to come to lunch at this new restaurant called Taco Craft. It actually just opened up near me and guess who's joining us? There he is. Welcome to the vlog. Oh, you're vlogging. I am. So yeah, this is a space that just opened up near my house. Um, the side is warm. Near my apartment. And I really would love to sit out there. We just got our food. I got tacos. John got tacos. Samantha got a salad. And her aunt's joining us. Aunt Cindy. What are you having? That's, that was her lunch. Enjoy, everybody. Just got back from lunch. We had a very good lunch. Samantha hung out for a little while. It was nice to have her here. I don't think she's been to any of my places in probably since we lived in Orlando together because her and I went to college together in Orlando. But anywho, um, I actually just got a package in the mail. I wanted to show it to you guys. It's kind of cool. It was gifted to me by Liquid IV, who I guess they have a new, they have a new flavor out. And I guess um, this is, they always send me cool things every time they release a new flavor. So I kind of just wanted to show you guys what they sent. So they sent this cute bucket hat. Not that I wear bucket hats. Um, also a disposable camera, which I thought was cool. A, I guess like a bandana handkerchief kind of thing. Also a hyaluronic ceramide mist. And then I guess it's like a flask type thing. And last but not least, the actual liquid IV cotton candy flavor. It just came out. Haven't tried it yet, but I'm sure it's delicious. And then this cool backpack. So thank you, Liquid IV, if you are watching. And John wants to say something. Uh, yes, I do. So what'd I received- you, What'd you get? A really wonderful early birthday card. Uh, thank you, Patrick. And really lovely card, um, as well as a handwritten message. Yeah. And so I just want to say thank you. And plus, it was also a really nice gift. And he sent this for your birthday. He sent it for my birthday, and <laughs> he knows we like Starbucks. So he sent us a, or sent me a Starbucks gift card, which, trust me, we'll use. Yes. Uh, so definitely want to say thank you give it a shout out to Patrick for that and I was really touched. Yes, Thanks Patrick. So Thank you. The next day. It is 7.57 a.m. We woke up early to take the dogs out because John's going to school today. Today is John's full day at school. So I'll be home all day. Just fine. I get to watch all my things on TV. Just relax. I'm going to go work out today. I'm going to go to Orange Theory, which I've been doing regularly and I really, really enjoy it. So before he goes to school, I'm going to make him some breakfast. Oh, and really quick, guys. I just got a jury summons in the mail. I got one at the start of the pandemic, which obviously that one was canceled. Told, and I got one just yesterday. It's actually during a vacation that I have planned for next month, a Disney World trip that we have planned for next month in May. I emailed them and I sent them my itinerary with my name to show them proof that I actually will be on vacation during the date that they want me to report. So hopefully they excuse me because I really don't want to have to miss out on my trip. Have you guys ever had jury duty? Let me know in the comments below. Like I don't know what that's like. Never, I've never done it. Anyways, I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'm gonna make like a, kind of like an egg McMuffin sandwich, but obviously the healthier version I'm gonna use turkey sausage, cheese, and a multigrain Thomas English muffin. It's only 100 calories.
here's your breakfast. Nobody <gasps> what he thinks about me. <laughs> That's Mia's breakfast, which for some reason she doesn't want to eat. She's being a brat. You know why? Because he's on a diet, so she wants to be like mommy. No, she wants to just have delicious things in her food. Yeah. Yeah, we're talking about you. Try your breakfast sandwich. It's healthy. It's only like it's only under 300 calories. It is. How it do you is. Know? Because they counted. The calorie counted. Give it a taste for the camera. Let everybody know how it tastes, how good it is. Mmm. Mmm. So yummy too. It's so tasty too. It's so tasty. So it's later in the day, um, I did go to my workout, and now I'm actually planning an Easter brunch that we might have here um, on Sunday. The Easter's coming up in just like five days from today, and I decided I wanted to do an Easter brunch, so I'm checking out like Target and Amazon, Party City to see like table decor for Easter, and then I'm also like trying to get recipe ideas to see what I could possibly make. But while I do that, I need some energy, and I'm gonna make a brown sugar shaken espresso inspired by the Starbucks version. Let me know down below if you guys have tried the Starbucks version of the shake and espresso brown sugar oat milk. I know it's like so long, <laughs> these Starbucks names. So same thing as yesterday, I'm gonna be using oat milk again. Then also, like about a week or two ago, I made brown sugar syrup, brown sugar simple syrup. I'm gonna do my espresso and yeah, let's see how it tastes. I haven't made it yet, so I'm excited to try it. I'm sure it won't taste the same as Starbucks, but. I put a little cinnamon on there. For some reason, I don't think it's gonna taste anything like the Starbucks. Hmm, actually, not bad. It's pretty close. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I really, really am. Wow. Mmm, it's really good actually. I'm very happy with it. Wow, I'm very shocked as you guys can tell. I guess I'm gonna be making that more often now. The next day. It is a new day. I have been so busy this morning. Um, it's actually 12.30 uh, in the afternoon. I've been so busy. I've done like three loads of laundry, cleaned the bathrooms, got in a car wash. I, I have been so busy. I started preparing food for tomorrow's trip. So tomorrow I go to work. I started a two day trip on the 787 Dreamliner again. All I've been working this month. This month I have not been on any narrow bodies. I've only been on the wide bodies, which I love because who doesn't love a wide body? It's just so much more space, so much more workspace. So I'm going to end this video here so I can start editing it and putting it out for you guys. I hope that the vlog came out good. I just, as I was filming it, I'm like, this is not going to be interesting at all. But let me know in the comments below what you thought about this video. If you're new here, please subscribe. Leave this video a thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram. On my trip tomorrow, actually, that I'm going on, I'm going to be working with Lucas again, who I worked with to New Orleans last month. So him and I are going to be working again to Dallas. So hopefully it'll be a fun trip and it'll be nice to be working with someone who I know already. So with all that being said, thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.